two, three. America! We're hearing guilty on one through five. This man's life is a Greek tragedy. Was he a bad boy here? Was he a bad boy there? One through 12, we have now 13, 14, guilty. Hillary deleted 33,000 emails. Hillary Clinton, I didn't say lock up. We're up to 18 counts, 19, guilty. American people need to wake, wake up. You know, this is a war. This is a literal war. We have a banana republic. I guess we all need, what, to shop at Banana Republic? We are now 24 counts in, all guilty. Every facet of Republican Party politics and power has to be used right now to go toe to toe with Marxism and beat these communists. Up to 26, guilty. It won't be Hunter Biden the next time. It's going to be Joe Biden. It could potentially still be Barack Obama. We are now up to 31 counts guilty out of 34. 32, guilty. We now have Soros elected DAs who go after people, not crime. We must stop these animals. People are sick and tired of a feckless, useless Republican Party that never does a damn thing to stop any of this. They're saying guilty on all 34 charges. The person that comes up out on top, though, in my mind, without a doubt, is President Trump. We have President Donald Trump, who is now a political prisoner and a martyr against the regime. Every signatory of the Declaration of Independence is a felon. Is it a good idea for the Republican Party to nominate a convicted felon? The answer is 100% yes. There is no way that the American people are going to vote for a convicted criminal. They're not. Do so you think she's wrong? Uh, yeah, apparently. Apparently we were both wrong on that one. Let's say Trump is behind bars. And again, it is a possibility. Is Would he make a speech from from prison? Everything is being considered at this point in time. I'd like him to say, gee, we have to have a little sorrow for this man. Because they don't, they just don't say that about me. I lock him up! I lock him up! I lock him up! I lock him up!